Welcome back to another episode of Cooking with Lexi. Today I'm wearing this nice little hat because it makes me feel like I should be in Paris or something. Not in Illinois. Anyways, I'm gonna bake some banana pancakes today. They're Whole30 approved and they taste very delicious. So they satisfy a pancake craving without having all the heavy carbs. If you like this video, be sure and give me a thumbs up and hit the subscribe button down here and make sure you hit that bell. I heard that's important. What we're gonna do is take one banana, put it in my bowl. Try not to get all the stringy things on there. I'm gonna take one egg, put it right in my bowl with my banana. Now, I'm just gonna mash it up. Now that I've got my egg and banana mixed together, I'm gonna add in some cashew butter. I personally like cashew butter. You can also use almond butter if you'd rather that too. Just depends the flavor you want. I'm gonna add in about a tablespoon of cashew butter. Take a dash of cinnamon. Oops, that's a big dash. Whatever dash you want. I'm gonna do a splash of vanilla for a little bit of flavor. About like that. Then we put just a sprinkle of baking soda. This will help the pancakes have a little bit of fluff. I'm gonna call it a quarter of a teaspoon. And then whisk this together. I have my banana mixture all mixed up. I'm gonna get my skillet hot and spray it with some Pam so that they don't stick. Then we're gonna make some pancakes. <laughs> pancakes for dinner. They look like they're just about ready to flip. When they got bubbles like this, that means they're ready. Don't worry if they get a little bit dark, that's just from the caramelization of the banana. So this batter is going to be runny. So when you flip it and maybe they don't turn out just perfect, that's okay. Look at mine. Just kind of do its own thing. They're just unique pancakes, that's all. Remember, pancakes are like people. Every one of them is different and unique. It's okay. I made my pancakes about silver dollar size. I don't feel like a kid again. I'm gonna top them with some more cashew butter because I just love cashew butter and then some fresh berries. Now comes my favorite part of the whole video when I get to taste test. Mm. It's so good. I wish you could try it too, but instead I'll just go ahead and eat my dinner. Thanks for tuning in to another episode of Cooking with Lexi.